What up YouTube, Joey Shattuck here. Gonna do a quick video on how to deposit and withdraw money at DraftKings Sportsbook. I'm gonna walk you through showing you know my account on the app and how that process works, uh, what your different options are, and all that good stuff. So let's get right into it. All right, so once you've logged into the app, there's essentially two ways to deposit and one way to withdraw money. So you can deposit money with either the top left uh, part of the app with the person with the silhouette or the top right part of the app with the plus sign next to the dollar amount. And for withdrawing money, you're just going to want to click on the person with the silhouette and then, you know, either deposit or withdraw there. Uh, and then on the right hand side, if you're looking to deposit money, you can load up like this and it'll show you all your different deposit options. So depending on the state that you live in, your deposit options will be different, but most states should have credit or debit card or online banking or PayPal. And then there's usually a couple other miscellaneous ones, but I by far and away recommend just using the online banking. It's so much easier than any of these other methods other than, you know, credit, debit card or PayPal. Those are pretty easy too, but it's just super easy because you literally just look at, you know, you you search for your bank here. So if I'm a Capital One customer, I just click Capital One and then I just log in with my username and password and then I select the account that I want to deposit from and then, you know, that's it. And it deposits instantly, right? So I have the money like within a minute. It's not like I don't have to wait for anything. Whereas, uh, going back here, whereas if I were to do some of the other methods, like uh, you know, wire transfer or, or whatever, I might have to wait a little bit. So online banking is by far the easiest. So I do recommend that. And then going back to withdrawing the money. So if I go to the top left here with the silhouette and then I click withdraw, uh, it'll show me my, you know, total available amount to withdraw. So if you have a bonus or whatever, then that number might be a little bit different from your cash balance. Um, but yeah, then you would essentially just type in the amount that you want to withdraw and hit continue. Uh, I'm not going to do that just because it does show my address and, and more account details. Um, but it's essentially the same screen as the deposit screen. You just click on, you know, online banking or PayPal, and then you just enter your account information and then, you know, you're good to go. And the withdrawals are actually pretty quick too. Um, the couple times I've withdrawn money, I've gotten it. I mean, typically within a day. So, uh, pretty quick turnaround. And again, that's kind of why I recommend the online banking for both depositing and withdrawing. It's just the fastest and easiest way to do it. Um, but yeah, there are those other methods. And again, they do vary by state. So depending on what state you're in, you might have more or less options. Uh, but yeah, you know, it's, it's pretty easy to deposit and withdraw money. So I hope this video was helpful. Um, any questions, feel free to fire away in the comments and I'll, I'll try and get to them. Uh, but yeah, please like, subscribe, share and all that good stuff. And thank you for watching.